you would have already seen in our previous video, CyberLink Media Show 4 can be used to manage photos. Now it's time to show you how videos can be managed and enhanced using Media Show 4. If you have not seen our first video or read our guide, I'd recommend you to do so. With Media Show, you can edit any kind of video, ones you've filmed yourself or ones you've grabbed from YouTube. I've downloaded a favorite of mine from YouTube and I want to enhance the video a bit and give it some cool effects. Start the video module by selecting the video option from the Media Show 4 launch screen. First, import the video. Click on the Import button, select Source, and then browse to the folder where I put the downloaded video. Click OK. Click once on the imported file in the Source panel. Click on Import Selected. If you wish, you can provide some information about the video. Click OK. Done. And finally, the Back button. To start the editing, select the video and click on the Edit Function button or right-click on the video you want to edit and select Edit. As you can see, there are several function buttons located on the toolbar which allow you to do the following tasks. You can dynamically change the video playback size using this slider. You can add the video to your favorites. Rotate the video left or right. You can fix the shaky videos and also adjust the lighting and background noise. You can also fine-tune the videos. If you want to crop out some portion of the video, you can use this Trim option. You can add tags to your videos. Just click on the plus button to add more tags. When you're done with the editing, you can create a movie of your video. Click on the Create tab and then on Movie. Here you need to select a style from the list. I'll select Romantic because it best matches with the theme of the video. You can click on the Mix button to set the level of master and background sound. If you wish, you can also add other music tracks by clicking on the plus icon. By clicking on the Setting Function button, you can configure the output of the video. When you think that the movie is ready, click on the Produce Movie button. Select the destination where you want to save your movie and click Create. You may need to wait for a while as Media Show produces the final copy of the movie. After your movie is produced, you can burn the movie to a DVD. To do that, from the launch screen, click DVD, the third button. Import your videos by clicking on Import More Media. Enter a title. Select a menu style. If you want to have a slideshow of some photos, you can do that by importing photos to the Add Photos section. Click on the Preview button to make sure your movie is ready to burn, and click on the Burn button to start the burning process. Insert a blank recordable DVD into the optical drive and click on Yes. After a few minutes, your DVD will be ready to play on any DVD player. As you can see, it's easy to create great home movies with just a few clicks. For detailed steps, please read our article on video editing and burning DVDs with Media Show 4.